Sounds of gunfire could be heard and smoke seen from a distance at a hotel in the Somali capital of Mogadishu. Authorities say at least 12 people, mostly civilians, have been killed after Al-Qaeda-linked militant Al-Shabaab attacked the Hyatt Hotel, seizing hostages. The attackers blasted their way into the building with two car bombs Friday evening before opening fire inside, even bombing out stairs to make it harder for police to conduct their rescue. Somali security forces could be seen on site and cordoned off the road outside the hotel. The sounds of the battle taking place ringing out throughout the neighborhood as officials work nearly 20 hours to end the siege. Footage posted on social media shows people screaming and running onto the streets trying to get away from the scene. At least one explosion could be heard during the video. The Hyatt Hotel is a popular venue for lawmakers and other government officials. The assault on the hotel was the first major attack since President Hassan Sheikh Mohammed took office in May. The incident comes as government forces have stepped up their operations against al-Shabaab as part of a promise the president made to eliminate the armed group. Al-Shabaab has been fighting to overturn the Somali government for more than 10 years. The group's goal is to establish its own rule based on a strict interpretation of Islamic law. So far, there's no word on the identity of the victims. Melissa Nakavali, City Next, News.